whenever we're coming home, wherever we're going out, anything. She always grabs hers. When we first adopted her, it was January of 2014. To that point, we tried to get her a toy. She really wasn't interested. And then she was walking through a toy store one day, and for whatever reason, she just looked over and she saw him and she was glued. She actually picked him up off the shelf. And ever since, it's been the exact same toy. She carries him everywhere. She has plenty of other toys. Oh, there you go. Good girl. Good girl. It was really one of those turning points for her because she had been rescued as part of a backyard breeding situation. You okay? When she found Bruce, I swear it was just like a late switch turned. It just opened up. It was the most random and amazing thing. I think she found herself. She found some courage. She found some like inspiration. It was instantaneous. This is, yeah, the same toy she's had for the past four, four years. We wash him quite regularly. Lexi gets a bit panicked. You know, she won't just grab anyone. She's very particular about what she grabs. So she'll look for him when we come home. She'll like, oh, where is he? What do I do? She'll find him specifically and then she'll run to the door. So it's really the sweetest thing. Lying in front of the fireplace during the winter times, Lexi will take Bruce and she uses him as a pillow. There's an annual fireworks festival in Vancouver. I swear she held on to Bruce from 9 p.m. until 2 in the morning. Did not let go at all. It breaks your heart, but at least you know she has something. There's no judgment, there's no requirement. They're there for each other. I think to her, he is, he's her freedom. Bruce is the thing that allowed Lexi to finally break out of that shell, to finally make that leap forward from existing to being and experiencing the world. She just became all that more brave. With him by her side, with him in her mouth, she's a little more cheeky, she's a little more fun. I think it just allows her to be that little bit more herself. It's a massive sense of comfort for me as well. What's you doing, silly girl? What you doing? Hey, Lex. Lex. Yeah, got it, Bubbles. <laughs> hey, guys, I'm Roman. I've got a really special story for you. 